Planet Zoo has been rated E10 plus by the ESRB for crude humor, mild blood, and mild violence. It is generally suitable for people aged 10 years and up. Hey there, folks. This is Jack. Welcome back to the zoo. Um, I do apologize. I, I uh, like I said last time, we've reached a point where there's so many animals in the zoo that I'm getting alerts like every second. So I do have the game paused. Um. You know, uh, but everything's working out pretty well. Everything's working out pretty well. Things are looking good. We got, gosh, almost almost 3,000 people in the zoo. And they're all happy. The animals are doing well. And, you know, I'm, I'm okay too. I hope you guys are doing okay. The zoo looks fantastic. And if you look at it from space, the entrance is up here can see it's filling out nicely. What I'm going to do today is I'm going to take this space here, and yes, I did do a little path work just to see if it would work, and turn it into a habitat for the African savanna elephant. I'm looking forward to it. I hope you're looking forward to it. I'm going to unpause it for just a moment, and then repause it. There we go. So I'm going to turn this over to a time lapse and get working and uh, I will see you with the other side. Hope you enjoy what you're about to see. I'm going to have fun. I always have fun doing these builds. So I will uh, talk to you shortly.
Okay, so here is your African savanna elephant habitat. I think it worked out after I figured out that I was seriously misunderestimating the amount of space these animals needed. They're fantastic animals, aren't they? And they're vocalizing. That's a good thing. Um, so yeah, I had to use up a lot more space than I planned on, but you know what? That's okay. If the animals need it, the animals need it, right? Besides, I'm thinking about running a path back here. I would have to add more things down here, but you know, this is looking good. This is looking good. I like it. It works. You get some plants going here. All right. Okay, here we go. Yeah, this works. This works a lot. I like it. Did I miss anything? Yeah, the bear's cheap here is fighting because there's too many males. I'm betting. Yep, here they are. Who do we got? We got... Ah, well, you know, he can go enjoy life in the wild. Bye, Akandio, sir. We're about to have gary old babies. Lions are fighting for alpha status, probably because too many males. Here, let's do it. Let's look at this part. Yeah, too many males. Look at this. The babies. Grew up, let's just, really some of the, I have him on birth control, but somehow these, these female lions, the female adults are still getting pregnant. There we go. That should take care of that. Okay, so we have our elephant habitat. Like I said, it's a little bit bigger than I expected, but that's okay. This is the fun of the game. I like how it looked out. Uh, it worked out. I like the fence and the guest area. Let's see how the guests are thinking about it. The view of the African savanna elephant from here is quite good. You can really tell they put a medium, a medium amount of thought into planning. <laughs> a medium amount. Well, yes, ma'am, that's true because I had uh, originally, I originally underestimated the amount of space they needed, but that's okay. She says she's thirsty, so we need to get a, a drink. Uh, a drink machine or something like that in and around here. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I had a lot of fun putting this together. I hope you had a lot of fun watching it. I will talk to you in the next episode. The next episode, by the way, I got to tell you, we're going to do another one of these. Um, another one of these strange and unusual uh, mod animals. Specifically, what we're going to do, I had it here a minute ago. Had it here a minute ago. Where did I put it? That's a lemur, by the way. This little guy. This is the Eastern Quali. He's only found in Australia. Um, it's a carnivorous marsupial. And we're going to put a, in the next episode, we are going to put a habitat for them up here. And then I'm going to slowly work down and fill in these holes so it kind of squares off the zoo. You see what I mean? If we put a couple of habitats in this area and one down here, it'll kind of sort of square it off. Not quite completely, but you know what I mean. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it. I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.
Okay, folks, that'll do it for this session of Planet Zoo. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked what you saw, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And if you want to say something to me, anything at all, please make a comment down below. Again, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. As old and as true as the sky The forest protected shall prosper The forest neglected shall die Even aptitude to change attitudes As we have to prove it That planet to grab your shovel Let's work to do the world in trouble